Tonight, a Tampa City Council member is calling attention to black on black crime after opening up about his feelings about the Trayvon Martin verdict at a public meeting. Our Carson Chambers is live in downtown Tampa with this story. Carson? Good evening, Brendan. And Council member Frank Reddick says he does not agree with the Zimmerman verdict, but he also doesn't agree with the fact that a local Tampa murder has not gotten adequate attention. They're a very respectable person. Everyone admired his uh, personality. Everyone admired his uh, professionalism. Tampa City Council member Frank Reddick lives right around the corner from the dollar store where a manager lost his life Sunday. He came back home to help his sick mother and he got a job at Family Dollar and he rose up to the rank of manager and they'd be killed. Tonight, Reddick is calling the African American community to action in the wake of a senseless murder. I found out that he was killed by a person that looked just like him. And, and it was a senseless killing. No one is out protesting. No one is out marching. And this is a black on black crime. Police say the Army and Air Force veteran was shot and killed while trying to help his clerk when 23 year old Demetrius Parks came in with a gun. He rushed out of a locked office where he was safe to try and protect his co worker. Reddick called attention to black on black crime at a city council meeting on Thursday and says he's received support from the community. The next step, he says, is putting together a task force to start a conversation about the issue. What I would like to do is establish a dialogue. A dialogue with uh, citizens of this community, uh, particularly African Americans. Uh, we're going to have to take on this challenge. And Reddick also says that he is considering organizing a uh, protest or a march. Live in Tampa, I'm Carson Chambers, ABC Action News.